So in this video, we'll look at how we can sync our twin motion project into our Revit. So when we change something in Revit, uh, it will change in twin motion. Uh, and we'll also look at how we can save uh, projects and then reopen them again. So whilst I've got this project open, we can have a look at how we can sync the projects together. So we've got this project here and we can see we've got this window. This is a bathroom window or a toilet window next to this larger window here. And if I go into my Revit file, uh, we can see that same window there. If I have to click on that window and then delete it, for instance, um, when I go into my twin motion, it's still there. Uh, so when I'm in Revit, what I need to do is go back into my View tab, go into Twin Motion, and then Synchronize. When I click on Synchronize, when I go back to my Twin Motion now, you can now see that it's matched what my Revit uh, project is doing. So the, the window's now disappeared. Um, if I go back into my Revit, and then let's say, for instance, I undo that, um, obviously I need to go back into Twin Motion. You can see it's not happened. So just go back into Revit and back into Twin Motion, and then we can synchronize that and then you can see it's come back again. So that's um, working uh, the two together uh, and keeping them synchronized. When it comes to saving a project, so if I come up to the top left-hand corner and let's go File and then go Save As, um, I'll call this one, uh, just call this one Test for now, and click Save. Uh, you can choose where you're going to save it. This one's now saved, and I can now close down uh, Twin Motion, and I'm back now back into my, uh, my Revit model um, and when I come back in here again if I go uh, twin motion and open twin motion I come back to my um, startup page and this time I'm going to open it as an existing project rather than a new project so when I go into existing projects click OK it's going to come back and this is the one I've just saved this test file so I double click on that to open it up and it will bring back sometimes you get these uh, path errors just click OK and then now we're back uh, to where we were before. So um, I've now opened up and I can carry on working and making any changes. Uh, and that's quite important that you do save your files uh, and manage that process properly. Otherwise you could end up losing a lot of your work.